One of the greatest values that has made me who I am today is humility. Like most of us, I was raised by a single mom who worked two jobs just to put food on the table for my siblings and I to get a better education. We faced trials and tribulations that made me understand life is what you make it. Do what you're passionate about and what makes you happy. Well, aside from being passionate about my job, watching reality documentaries and being a nature lover, Mi upenda viatu wasi. Sijali kama ni designer ama second hand pale ngara. As long as they fit. <laughs> My friend. Vile tu had the band walisema. Uliza kiatu. My name is Sheila, restaurant operations manager Mama Rocks. And this is my staff story. So basically all of this started in 2019. That's when I joined Mama Rock. And I remember in my previous job which I worked for three and a half years. I was not happy, you know. I was yeah, I was getting benefits and all that, but I wasn't happy and I did not like the person I was becoming because I remember I was just moody. I even t- like I even characterized myself as a workaholic. But I wasn't a workaholic. It's just that I had lost myself in the whole process. So I remember peeping because my previous job used to just be next to Mama Rock, and I remember peeking outside the window. I was like, "I like to have fun. I'd like to have that." I remember telling my friend, "I have a good friend." I remember telling my friend, "I'm not happy with this job. What can I do? What do I need to do?" And my friend just told me, "Jump." and i remember taking the jump which was resigning first and i was so scared because i was supporting myself and this was my only source of income and jumping means leaving everything and starting afresh and me starting afresh was accepting i need to start from the bottom to grow my way up to the top and i had it in me because i knew what i wanted some of the biggest challenges i faced through my transition from a supervisor to a restaurant manager has been staff management and i can say staff management because i came to realize managing people is not easy it needs patience it needs understanding it needs compassion and also it needs someone to be discerning you know and Through my journey, I learned um, I need to get out of the crowd to be a leader. So for a long time, I stayed in the crowd, trying to please staff, but also trying to please the company. And for this, I didn't have a balance. So things at some point were not going right, and I had to step back and think, okay, what am I not doing right, or what am I doing right? So. I had to step back as I said and then rethink and then look at the objective look at the tasks I've been given to fulfill and then ask myself is this what the company wants from me or is this what the staff need from me so it took me a while to transition but finally I got to the point where I am a leader and people carry me as a leader and people have believed in me to lead them in their daily lives and also like they believe in me to accomplish all the goals they've given me for me Priscilla uh basically all makes me me is humor and wit and fun it's never that serious guys like i'm not your typical manager miss going to serious by the way but i get things done in a serious way so Yeah, like look at me. Look at my hair. Look at So yeah, that's me and on top of being a humorous person, someone who enjoys laughter, I'm also a resolute person. Like I see what I want, I go for it. Like if you asked me 5 years ago, Sheila, I need you to be like do you see yourself as a manager? I would have told you, yeah, 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 because this is my goal because I'd left everything behind because I had set my eyes on the prize so yeah i'm resolute and i'm sociable 
My name is Sheila, Restaurant Operations Manager Mama Rocks, and this is my staff story. <laughs>